Hello internet, it's almost Christmas and this jumper is going to be so annoying throughout this whole video. Since it's almost the end of the year and it's almost Christmas time, I thought I would just film a little festive video to sum up my year and what I've done and get excited about Christmas. I really love Christmas and I feel like this year I have completely got into the Christmas spirit. We rearranged our entire living room and decorated it so well this year. But like the tree which is behind me and we put tinsel around our five sauce posters and it's just very Christmassy in this house and I love it. I watched Elf which I think is one of my favourite Christmas movies and I will be watching Love Actually on Christmas Eve because me and my parents always watch it, it's like a little tradition. I've got two and a half days of work left and I will be driving three hours to my parents to spend Christmas with them, coming home to work between Christmas and New Year and then it will be the new year, it will be 2016. So I also thought what I would do is take a look at the goals that I set myself at the end of 2014. I thought I would have a look at those goals and see how this year has gone. I'm just gonna go through it really quickly because some of them are kind of the same and some of them are really boring, but here we go. I wanted to learn to play the guitar properly, which I have not done. I never do it, I always say I'm gonna do it, I'm not even gonna bother putting it on my 2016 list because I've just accepted it's not gonna happen. Maybe I need to work more on not giving up. That might be the first thing to work on. I also wanted to get a Luke kissing picture. If you're new to my channel, I really like Five Sauce, blah blah blah, tune out now. Sometimes I try and meet Five Sauce and I really wanted a picture where Luke Hemmings was kissing my cheek or I was kissing his cheek and this did not happen. I did try though. It was all very embarrassing and it was a situation where there were a lot of fans outside a rehearsal studio and everyone was only allowed one picture each. So I took a picture and then I looked at him and I was like, can you kiss my cheek? And then he was like, uh, I'm just gonna do normal ones. And I was like, oh, okay then, thanks. <laughs> and that was it and I don't wanna talk about it anymore but I did try. So that's the point, right? I also wanted to film more videos this year, which I feel like I have done. I filmed my whole Florida trip, Five Sauce tour, like most of the fun things that I've done this year I filmed, which is what I really wanted to do because I like being able to look back at them. I don't know if that's weird, but it's really fun to look back at because there's things you film that you don't even remember doing and you're like, oh my God, yeah, that was so funny. That was awesome. But I just watch videos of myself doing things with my friends. That's cool. The other things that I wanted to do were sort of along the lines of eating healthier, exercising more, living myself, being a better person. All of these things, I think, involve how you feel about yourself and your mental health and things like that. And this year I did take a trip to the doctors because I realized something wasn't right in my head. I was sort of panicking and worrying all the time about everything and I realized that's not normal. I don't have to feel that way. So I went to the doctors and I got put on antidepressants which I've been on for four or five months now. I feel good, I feel so much better. It's very strange for me to sit down and to suddenly realize I'm not panicking right now, I'm not worrying about anything, which shouldn't be weird, but it is. I'm gonna give myself a pat on the back for that because it is important to realize how far you have come. Moving on from things that are quite serious, I thought that I would talk about some of my favorite moments of this year. Do you know what? To do this, I'm gonna go through my Instagram because there will be pictures and then I can show you pictures. That's quite a good idea. I'm just gonna scroll way back to January. If this picture wants to load, hello, <laughs> please load. <laughs> <sighs> this is this is what life is like living with our Wi-Fi in this house. Our Wi-Fi is called Michael Five Sauce, which is obviously why it doesn't work. So I went to see Fall Out Boy in January at Islington Assembly Hall, which is a really, really tiny venue, and I couldn't see a lot, but it was really good. And then I stole this poster, which we now have up in our living room. Seeing my favorite band is obviously always gonna be one of my favorite things, so that was really fun. What else happened this year? I think a lot of selfies this year, that's for sure. For my birthday, which was in March, me and Amy went to see the Book of Mormon in London. And this was us meeting Nick and standing outside. We also went to Jano Fest to see the Janoskians, where we felt like complete little old ladies. Like we shouldn't have been there, but we had the best time. It was just so much fun. And I think that's important to go and be ridiculous and have fun. So that was one of my highlights of the year. Went to see William Beckett in Birmingham. And these are some really cute selfies that I took with him. And I had never had a selfie with him before. So I was happy with that. Those are really cute. Me, Amy and Becky went to see McBusted, which was awesome. That's everything we did there. I met Five Seconds of Summer a few times, really like literally just a few. This year was full of so many fails. This is me and Luke outside the studio that I mentioned after and that's him looking at me after I said, can you kiss my cheek? And he was like, no. Oh, I went to my friend Laura's hen party, which was super cute. 
her bridal shower where we ate fancy food and had afternoon tea. Oh my god, I've seen Fall Out Boy three times this year, not twice. Me, Nettie and Shiv went to see Fall Out Boy at this little recording thing for MTV. Um, got there really late, couldn't get in. I ended up crying and then this man was like, let me see what I can do. And this lady took us in and I was just crying because I loved them so much. So that was, that was horrible, but then also it ended well. And then me and Nettie trekked across London to see Cartel after Fall Out Boy. So it ended up being a really good day. Oh my God. Me and Amy flew to Belfast to see Five Seconds of Summer. So it was the first show of the UK tour. Here's the final bow that they did, I'll show you that. Everything went wrong. I had a stomach bug. We, I booked, I personally booked the hotel for the wrong day. On the way back, our flight got delayed. Here's me sitting in the airport. I have never felt so ill in my life and we missed five sauce because we got stuck at security. We missed them about, by well, about five minutes at the airport. So. <laughs> I mean, it makes for a great story and it just sums up my entire life, but we still managed to have fun throughout it. So, yep. <laughs> then we did the rest of Five Sauce Tour. Here is a picture of Pod Squad. Uh, this was probably one of my favorite nights on tour where we were all on calm side in the pod, drunk dancing. Uh, it was when I started to get over my stomach bug. I felt better and it was just awesome. We also, met Hey Violet a couple of times. And here is my favorite picture where we did Charlie's Angels with them. Five Sauce Tour definitely like up there with the highlight of my year, I think. After that, I went to my friend Roots' wedding. Here is her and her husband during their first dance, which was amazing. The wedding was so good. And also me and some of my friends wore saris and I felt like an actual princess for the whole day. So here we are in our saris and it was just awesome. Oh my God, I got to hang out with Laura and James and Nettie. Here's a really cute selfie that we took. I went to Florida, which was great. And the sun is not gonna be working for this video right now. I am so sorry. Here are some pages from Florida. This is me with a beach ball I got in West Palm Beach. Um, from the Five Sauce show. This is a really cool picture actually. This is me at Universal City Walk when we first got there. So the whole of America was great. I'm gonna show you all the pictures. They're all on my Instagram, which I'll link below if you want to see them. This is maybe my highlight of the entire year when I met Pete Wentz finally and got a selfie with him. That's it. Nothing can beat that for me. He is my emo king and that's it. That's where, I think that's definitely where I'm going to, oh no, no, that's not where I'm going to stop. Also got packed with Luke Hemmings. Finally, thank you, photographer. Went to see One Direction with Amy and Nettie on Halloween. We dressed up. It was awesome. They played Act My Age like 50 times. Me and Jodie went to Mosh for her birthday. Uh, here we are, looking awesome. I'm so happy I got to spend your birthday with you and I want to see you way more next year, please. This is where I'm gonna end. We went to see Hey Violet after getting stuck in traffic for six hours, you've seen that video. Squad girls, here's us with Hey Violet, looking awesome. So I think that 2015 has been pretty great. I actually didn't realize how many awesome things I'd done until I looked back at those pictures. So Merry Christmas, I hope you have a great one. I hope you have a good new year and I will see you in 2016 for some more fun things. Have a good one guys, bye bye.